Well, hello everybody. Thanks for stopping by. We are on day four of our advent calendar. And so far, I have been really, really happy with both um, advent calendars. Uh, I get a little leery about ordering stuff like that because advent calendars are pricey. And the last thing you want to do is spend a lot of money and get junk. So, I knew I wasn't, I knew what was in store for me from the Paul Ply yarn because I bought their advent calendar before. But I wasn't sure about the Cambridge Fibers out of Canada. This is the first time I'm having one. And I am really, really impressed. I am really pleased um, at the advent calendar so far. So, let's get opening. So, this is day number four. And this is the Paul Ply yarn. It, this is this is hand dyed um, merino and nylon. So, these colors won't ever be repeated. And, ooh, look at this. Ooh, pretty, pretty purples. Pretty, pretty purple. Man, is that pretty. Look at that. Look how pretty that is. Gorgeous. Let's see what the colorway is. Um, ooh, Sugar Plum Fairy is the color of this one. Sugar Plum Fairy. Awesome. Awesome, awesome, awesome. We'll get this put back in here. I know these videos are short, um, but that's okay. I... I wanted to keep them short um, for the advent calendar and uh, because there's no sense of dragging making a 20 minute video for a five or six minute video I'm not gonna do that to you guys I promise so now here's this it's got the sweater on it like the other two don't know what's in here but we're gonna find out and this is day four. This is from Cambridge Fibers. I love how um, both uh, advent calendars, how they wrapped uh, their calendars. Daniel has these, um, the Paul Ply guy. He's got these beautiful wrappers, these little bags with like snowflakes on them. And then he's got the little paw print that is just adorable. And the Cambridge Fibers, she actually wrapped them up in um, Christmas paper or tissue paper. There is, what, maybe four of them that's shoved into a um, grocery a grocery bag, a paper bag, which is perfectly fine. I am, I am happy with that. There's... I have no qualms with that at all. Uh, growing up poor, as I did, it wasn't common for us to use the Sunday paper. Back in the day, the Sunday comics would be in color. Only on Sunday, it would come out in color. Well, being poor, we didn't have money for fancy wrapping and stuff like that. So mom would save those comics and she would wrap our Christmas in it. And just coming down and looking um, at the presents under the tree wrapped in uh, newspaper was a good memory. It is for me. Ooh. Is this a pretty color? Look at that. Now this is cotton. Uh, my guess. 
Um, Lily sugar and cream would be my guess. But there's an there's enough here to make um, uh, a wash rag, dish rag. So yeah, awesome, 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 awesome. So with that being done, I will bid you farewell and I hope everybody's having a great December and I love you guys and I will see you in my next video. Bye.